All right. Well, we're still waking up, loading up our area. There's the village over there, everybody. And the other one behind me. Yeah, right over just ahead of my head, just there. Just right over there. There's the one village. And there's the other. And here's where our castle will be. Yeah. Hello, everybody. Hi. I'm Lewis and Zach. Welcome back for uh, another one of episode of our Joy of Minecraft for relaxation, creation, and fun. Yeah. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. Thanks for liking and subscribing. Uh, it's free. It really helps us out. So, uh, yeah, today we're going to create that castle. Well, not the castle, but just the quick outline of where it will be in the future. The, uh, the foundation outline. Yeah. So let's get back to creating our story. All right. So another one of the builders here. See, I said there's others. Yeah. Looks like some uh, landscaping's going on. And structure over there. House. We'll check that out. So we were seeing all this at the end of the last one. But not so much of the landscaping. Yeah. All this wild grass. Do some land clearing ourselves. <laughs> yeah. So there's our beginning village there. And like I said, the mountain village here. Now we want that castle to be somewhere in here. And uh, I need to get us um, a lot of cobblestone. So we're going to go do that. Got to watch out for holes. This is still uncivilized terrain. You never know what could happen. It could be a hole anywhere. <laughs> Usually it's not too bad, though. In the deserts, you got to watch out for that. All right, so back in there, nice little flowery, cleaned up village here. There's the community home. A nice little place, temporary home. And we should eat some bread, actually. Let's have a bite to eat. Yum, yum. All right. Okay. We still have some doors that we didn't really need, so that's, that's good. We'll put those away for now, for later. We don't really need those right now. And we'll put that in there. Let's see. Yeah, we'll hold on to that dirt for a second. Yeah, maybe we'll put the wood with the other wood. Try to keep it organized. Somewhat. <laughs> okay, seven stacks should do it, for what I'm thinking. But we'll bring it along a little bit more anyway. Just so we've got a little extra. So we don't have to come back here too soon. Actually, we can maybe even afford another one. Is it nighttime yet? Nope. It's just dark in here for some reason. The glow of the torch. Okay. Some dirt there. And wood. And we'll put that other wood up there. Some of those torches up there. Alright. Actually, maybe we'll switch to these torches, yeah. That way we've got some extras. You know, I was just thinking, actually, we're going to be laying out torches anyway. Pretty much all along the way. And we might need dirt, so I'm going to put that back after all. That stone pickaxe is in very bad condition. Hmm, it must be one of the ones we picked up. Yeah, I like the sun. Wow. It's 
nice day. Mm -hmm. Got our sword. <laughs> Ready for anything. Need a bow and arrow in the future. And armor. And, and, and a lot of things. But we've got a plan today. We've got things to do. Yeah, so let's see. Refamiliarize myself. You know, that's another reason why it's great to make these little um, villages strong. And then, in my opinion, I guess I'd call it a survival camp. You know, like a base camp. Where a venture camp, where you'd have all your gear and resources and stuff, you know, based off of operations. And then later on, a big home, like a castle, like we're going to build. And then uh, uh, through building all these things, it makes it, all these landmarks, makes it easier to find your way around. Makes it, oh, less worry about things like that happening to you. Where you fall into, into holes. Dangerous holes. Oh, there's iron there. Come back for that later. But for now, we can make it safe. There's that zombie down there. But it's alright, he's trapped in there now. Nice and safe. And we've lit it up a little bit too. Just that no, we don't have to worry about any bad things in the darkness. That's why we bring extra torches. And I should be laying them out all along here. Probably. But I'm not sure where here is yet. So we're going to find that out. Okay, so there's the village. Where is the mountain village? There it is. Okay, mountain village. Oh, uh, yeah, the western village, the eastern village. Just to make it easy to keep in mind. We'll probably have further away western villages and eastern villages. Or western villages, eastern villages in the future. But, you know, I'm hoping that we can make this all one big looking city around our castle kind of area as time goes by. But that's that's future thinking. That's, uh, that's way down the road. Right now it's just a field. <laughs> With ambitious thoughts. But that's, that's what you need. Ambitious thoughts. Creativity. Yeah, you can't really do any wrong. So you don't really have to worry about that too much. Just whatever you feel like. There's our friend in the horizon, neighbor. Yeah. Okay, so the village. And the other village. Okay. So what do you guys think? I, I think in this area it might actually be a good area. It's hard to tell because it's all it's all um, rugged, you know, and not level. I'm gonna get some higher ground here, right up here. Maybe, maybe we'll get even higher ground. Let's have a look. I'll put a little torch here. Okay. So there's a friend's little settlement over there. Some landscaping they're doing and the western village over there. Now we'll probably clear out all these trees, I think, just so we'll get a good clear view. Nice little riverfront there that we can do some fishing and maybe create a harbor or something for our castle. We'll see. Boat, all kinds of things. We'll see. And there's the eastern village, the eastern side of our castle. Kind of. This is loose directions, but, you know, helps to, to, um, to organize yourself a little bit and orient yourself on the landscape. So, if that's the case, I'm thinking, yeah, this, this area right here might actually be the perfect area. Though it isn't right now, though. Right now it's unfortunately a little rugged. Hmm. And I'm also thinking that it's a little low. It's not necessarily a bad thing, though. But I'm wondering if I'm going to need to raise that up a little bit. For certain spots. But I've got ideas for it, so that lowness might help us. Okay, well, that's pretty cool. So now we've got to figure out where the corners will be. Oh, oh! I built this stair just so I could jump off and not do damage. <laughs> that worked not so well. It's all right, we lost some hearts and I could just eat a piece of bread and we'll start healing. But, you know, we could just wait for our hunger to go up. There's no real threat around right now, nothing to worry about. It's all safe and sound. So, we could just wait. 
be more efficient, eat our bread when we need to, not be wasteful. Yeah. All right, so now I'm just kind of beating the grass. <laughs> and uh, we're going to go over here, wander around a little bit, get familiar with the, uh, this is a, the, the castle foundation. We can move all this kind of stuff. There's not much going on here, just a little farm for, for this. Looks like actually somebody should trim it down. Maybe I should. This is sugar cane. And sugar cane can be used for sugar, but it can also be used to make paper. And paper is valuable to the villagers, and you can make books with it and all kinds of stuff. I also trimmed it down because it only gets so high. So now we've got it going so that it can grow some more. And we just picked up 19 pieces of sugar canes. So we'll come back to that later. These trees are probably going to go, or, well, be used as part of our building. Part of our, our castle. It's going to be a long process, though. We're going to have an outer perimeter, you know, like a, like a proper castle wall um, with corners that will be done later on, rounded. And we'll have um, an inner perimeter and then the actual castle foundation, but that's that's ahead of it. Right now we're just going to do an outline. Okay, village, village. All right, now let's switch over to our cobblestone. Mm. Yeah, well, actually we can just put away our hoe. We don't need our hoe right now. Because I'm thinking we might want the dirt. Perfect there. Go. All right. Now the question is the corner, like I said. Where would be a good corner? And we're going to build these villages closer and closer, so we don't want it to be too far away to take forever to build the village close. So this is probably a good area. I can build it closer. Maybe this would be a good corner area. But then how far away is it to the mountain castle? Hmm. Okay. Well, can we get a nice flat area to measure with, do you think? Maybe there would probably be best. Leading up to that water. Yeah, let's go right over here. Let's see if we can count it out a little bit. <laughs> okay, so this is probably too close because I want to build this out a little bit to the village. So, hmm, maybe if I built it out a little bit, maybe a little bit more. And we want to build towards that that uh, mountain village, and we want to have room for other things like maybe a stable and stuff like that that may or may not be inside the perimeter. So maybe somewhere around here might be a good area back from that village. And yet close enough that we're right beside it. Right? Hmm. Yeah, that's not going to work with the water though, is it? That's not going to be. Because I'm thinking around 100 squares, which is big. Not as big, I don't know. It's big for a regular single player game, but some people uh, like out there might might do bigger. They might recreate Hogwarts Castle. <laughs> that's, that's a very big project. So I don't know. I'm going to call this huge, but I imagine by by giant Minecraft standards, it's probably not huge. But huge for us. Another sundown. So I think the best is to measure right along this river if we're going to keep it and see where we end up. Put something right around here. So, so we want to give ourselves a little bit of space from the riverfront. Maybe right around here. Okay, so let's put this here. Let's try that. Torch there. Okay. That's just simply a marker for now. For now. Because I don't know where the middle will be to be able to mark it yet. Oh, but it looks like it's bedtime anyway. Oh, nope, not bedtime. Not bedtime. <laughs> I guess you have to wait for the full sundown. Not 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's count. We'll count that again in the morning. And it's bedtime. They could be underground, so we better let them know. Oh. Good time. Different happy face. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Night -night. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. We were that good at getting in our bed. We we're an expert, expert bed sleeper. <laughs> Just landscaping. That's our marker. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we probably want that there instead of the marker, right? Okay. Now, if I was thinking, hmm, well, we'll see. If I was thinking the halfway point, it'd be 50 squares out roughly. So one, two, three, four. Well, Am I counting that right? Grass gets in the way. Yeah. So I think we did this by 10. That should be right. <laughs> I always got to watch it, you know, this, at this point, it's not so hard later on, but if you do your foundation wrong, it's a pain later on, and you're like, what's going on? Yeah, and it's so easy to sometimes lose count. Maybe sometimes we should just mark it by twos, right? But I'm not even sure if this is really going to be our middle yet, or beginning, I'm not even sure how it'll fit, so. So I'll just have to see. Okay, so that should be about 50, but roughly half the one length of our outer wall. So it gives give me an idea of where it would be. Now there's the western village there, so we probably want to get a little closer on this side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now unfortunately I'm going to move these because I'm actually going to have a doorway in the between, and I'm not, but I'm not sure where the middle point would be. 
This would be 70 squares, I do believe. Okay. How are we doing? We're doing good. So let's go for more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. So that should be 80 squares. We have one before that one. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 20. Hmm. No. <laughs> the right, the right. 10, 20. Yeah, that would be to the one again. 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. Let's do that 10 more. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Now, do we want it closer still or further back? Hmm. And maybe this river will have to go and we'll have to redesign a new river or, or go over it or something. Hmm. Have to find out. We'll build that closer. But I think it will work, because there's still plenty of room, and that's gonna be a, a a roadway by the looks of it. So it should still work. Yep, it should still work. Alright, so, so we just need to count out another 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, oh no, we already did. Not that 10, this 10. But, actually, maybe we should fix it right now. Yeah, before I count that out, we, we still have to add one for our doorway. And if you don't know what I mean, it's okay, you'll, you'll get it soon. So, we're, we're not going to do an even number of 100 along our door, we're actually going to be doing a odd number. So so that we have one open square for our doorway. But where will it be? So that was where we'd figure out the middle point. Now I am liking this, so I guess we'll just keep it the way it is and just do 50. So then that keeps us close to that village and this one. Yep, that is the edge, just making sure, because it's hard to see sometimes if it's a block in there. I do two, but then I'm just gonna have to bring them up anyway. So yeah, so that might be the corner then. Let's put some torches on this one. Boom. Okay. All right. So there's 10, and there's 20, and there's 30, and there's 40. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Jeep. And there's 50, right? Oh, I lost track looking at the Jeep. Yep, 10, 20. 30, 40, 50. So that would be our 51 right here. Well, not right there, there. But that's why I'm going to put this here. Just as a little marker, we're going to destroy this later. Or maybe we'll leave it in the inside. I'm not sure yet. Hmm. But it's going to give us the idea for later of where things will be. Right? So that's where it'll be. The entrance. One of them. So we're going to see if this all works out. Okay. So that would be our number one there. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So yep, still works out right. So we just got to set these back one more. Now we could also start laying it out, but I wasn't sure, like this is not really level yet. If you're wondering why I'm just kind of doing it like this, it's because it's not really level right now anyway. It's just kind of markers, you know, so we know the uh, outer rim, outer wall. And even at that, we're only marking the one side. Hello. Hello, excuse me.
All right. I don't think... Yeah, we could go closer, but I guess we don't really need to. We're going to have a road beside there anyway. One, two, three. Boom. Okay. Then we're going to have to decide on the height. So I know where the level would be to even start, right? start lighting up this area a little bit. Take that grass. Take that, take that, take that. <laughs> Alright, pit time. Day dawns, everybody. Look at that. It's awesome. Okay. All right. Now, where are we again? <laughs> uh, it'll be easier as we start seeing the landscape, as we start seeing it form. Okay, so I think now we would pick a side and see if it works. Or we just start marking it out. So that'd be one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. That's the corner right, no other one. Oh. Good. Good. because sometimes you lose count of it and it moves. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's hard to track it sometimes. And I always have to double check it because I don't want to find out later that I was off by one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. See? I was off by one. I had a feeling. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Where are we now? <laughs> so, yeah, ten, and then twenty, and then thirty, and then forty. So this is the halfway point to the next one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Which would mean, if I'd followed that, that would be our doorway. Likely. 
we follow the way we're thinking so far. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I don't know why I'm getting the twelve, so we'll back it up to ten. <laughs> Uh, double check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Double that off. Gotta get used to counting again. I'm all out of practice in my Minecraft counting. It's gonna have to help me sharpen my skills. Oh, and that's partly because I'm counting there too. That should be counted as one, right? So that is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, that's why I was off. Fix that for us there, guys. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. Now on to the thirty. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I just lost count again. It's so much easier when you have easier stuff to count on. I seem to be having a hard time with it today. But we're doing fine. Getting through. Four, six, eight, ten. Yeah, let's um, let do something with this tree right now. Disappear the rest of it on its own. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, there's the village. Excellent. Okay, now ten, twenty, thirty. 40, right? 10, 20, 30, 40. Yeah, so we need another 10 there. 1, 2, 3. And this one, 4, yeah. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay. Alright guys, that would be one side right there. Wow, so we've got like one corner now. And we can't quite see it. I'm going to have to do some higher things. <laughs> some higher places to put them. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That should be twenty, right? Yeah, ten, twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, thirty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Fifty, if I'm not mistaken. I got a little off in there. Check here. 10 and 20 and 30 and 40 and 50. Yep, this would be our mid place. Hmm, just pieces of sturdy. 
three would just be like um, maybe uh, stumps, I suppose. Hmm. All right, so our other door would probably should be right here. Looks like it's right. How come I feel like I'm off over here? Yeah, it seems like it's off. But we'll double check here. I wonder if I should count my way across there just to be sure. Hmm. Well, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, six, twenty-seven. right but I'm gonna have to judge and make sure that's all on because it becomes nighttime again One more time. Dig your way out. Here we go. <laughs> Fell into a hole. We'll have to fix that. But yeah, I was looking. We should just fix that right now. Is there anything down here? No. does line up. Hmm. Just doesn't look like it does it sometimes. It looks like it's off to the left a little bit to me. <laughs> but I guess it's just me. It seems to add up. It's a big area to try to add up all by yourself though. A bite to eat and we'll start healing. Alright, so let's continue on then. shows where they'll be for the time being. At least I think be probably plenty of landscaping. Shouldn't landscape too much though because I might keep it just the way it is. So we'll see. Yeah, so let's just continue on mapping for now. Don't need those seats, so we'll just get rid of those for now. And they come back anyway. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That'd be twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, ten, thirty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, forty. And then one more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Mm. I think I messed that up. That should work out good. We'll just move this path back a little bit. Yeah, we can do that. Easily enough. I think it'll work. So that's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, my last count. Just let me do a check that. So this is, yeah, yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Gives us 20, right? Yep, 10, 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Oh, all those different levels. <laughs> places. Our shovel is broken. Got a new one. To watch out for that drop off. Okay. So that should line up. We can test that out after, I suppose. It's safer off of there. But in the meantime, we'll just continue on. This would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I 
of them out of our way. It's okay, we'll be growing lots of trees. So we'll be growing lots of trees back. see very easily so we'll just yeah 10 20 30 this would be on our way to 40 so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten that'd be 40 that's what i said so that should be 50 then one two three four five six Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Now how come we are off? <laughs> uh, we marked this as the corner, didn't we? And now we're another one. Hmm. So we did do some counting around. We'll fix it, it's not to worry. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, the good news is it's still squared, so so that's good. So we somehow just went out another one. So we can adjust that. Really, right now it's not exactly, you know, like I said, this is not the the foundation itself, even though I call it the foundation. It's more like our, it's more like the idea of a foundation. Right now it's just kind of uh, landscaping. Seeing if it'll fit is the first thing. And seeing what adjustments will need to be made if it does. Getting the right placement. Because like I said, I'd like to be close to this village and close to that village back there. But without being too close. And giving it room to grow on both sides towards us. Alright. Well. Another sunset taking place. Alright. Well, there she is. Where the swampland and well, not really swampland, but kind of looks like swampland because of the water here. These little lakes are and Pokemon pools and ponds. This will be where our castle will be. Our great castle floor. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very cool. All right, thanks for watching, everybody. Bye. -bye. We'll see you again next time for uh, episode four. We'll start really laying this out and landscaping and really starting to create the foundation for our whole land. See if we can help out the people some more and build up their villages too. Alright, thanks for watching. Thanks for liking and subscribing. Layoffs is out. Bye bye. Better get to bed. Bedtime. It feels like things are working out, coming together. Alright. Mr. G. Gonna have to create some some farms for all you guys. Some pens. Mm-hmm. <laughs>